Hello and welcome to my China, a China where we make structural engineering design simple and easy. My name is Olodu Konyedi and I'm your host. I want to say a very big thank you to everyone who has been sending questions and those who are subscribed to this China. We really appreciate you and if you are yet to subscribe, please hit the subscribe button. We've been getting a lot of questions. We have this question from Sam. Sam I see Bada. You said hi, <coughs> if I'm right. I haven't seen the AutoCAD file you said you have uploaded, which you said has the template for your structural drawing. Kindest regards, Samway. Samway, please go through uh, videos. We uh, check the description. We have. Um, uploaded it and this in particular this video I will still re-upload the link for you to to get the AutoCAD file but prior to this you can check our, our previous videos we have um, we have them there so you can just click and I will grant you access to um, to the file so that you can download and practice on your own the file will as we've promised it has been there for quite a while so just go through the videos check their description and you will get it but if not uh, uh, look at the description of this video that will be posting we'll still add the the link to that um, to that file so we'll promise you it's there check or if not wait until we we upload then check the description it will be there okay um, we have another question from another of our subscriber um, you are Benedict Dagba, da, Dagba. please um, if you are sending any comment please tell us where you are coming you are commenting from um, even um, the uh, somewhere you didn't tell us where you are commenting from please let us know where you are commenting from Benedict you say hi good day I want to know something that is confusing in proto structure building analysis on that slab model there is an option called use the compose slab load check when on check it and run analysis I discovered that my beam carried more steel ripper compared to when I checked it. I'm confused. Um, Benedict, please, I would like you, if you look at this, please tell me. I will assume what you are you are saying, but if if I'm wrong, please let me know by commenting below. You said you, you said. Um, under the slab model there is an option called use use the decomposed slab load check so if we look at it here this is analysis we have the load decomposition by fe is that what you are saying but if not please let me know so if you click it this is what i'm having this is what I'm having. So, uh, if you're having something different, please let me know. Where you will check, please let me know. But if you click this, the place you need to go to is the bash FE, where all these are all checked. I like to be checked. And you click OK. Once you click OK, it will run the the um, analysis automatically it will run it automatically to check for um, the slab the slab load it will check for the slab load so um, let's just see it will check for the slab the slab load so this is what it will do or well, if not um, I would like okay I would like you to um, Maybe send an email to my email, or if you can explain it better, 
it will be good for me to know what you are talking about so this is it I didn't see any other place where um, there's check and uncheck please um, let me know after you click this to apply to all please let me know so that um, uh, I can explain better but if not this is the only place I think I'm saying low decomposition by FE which is like finite elements you are, you are, if you use this pattern it gives you the best and the best design so far the most economic design by using this so but let me know what you are um, you are saying so that I can explain better so you can um, always chat me up um, in the comment section let me know if I answered yours correctly so it's better you use this so that it will give you the best the best um, design for you to to use so let me know if it answered your question yeah this is another um, comment from another uh, of our subscriber he said uh, the name is Kadu Dokstan don't stand please whenever you are sending us comment please let us know where you are commenting from if you are in Nigeria please tell us the state you are commenting from but if you are outside Nigeria please let us know the country you are you are commenting from it will help us to know how far our, our videos are going and how it has been helpful I will know how to tailor uh, our videos to suit each and every country that it gets across to so that everybody can benefit from our videos so Kadun Kadun yeah you said good evening sir I have now understood how to design both cantilever slab beam thanks a lot I really appreciate that please keep those comments coming please let us know if you you are benefiting from it so that we can do more of it and also if you are yet to subscribe to this channel please just hit that subscribe button hit that like button so that um, you can get notified when next we put up our video and also it kind of encourages us to do more to do more so please hit that subscribe button that is the only way you can appreciate our efforts that we will do day in and day out so once again I want to say thank you for the comments and the questions please keep them coming I will always um, answer you when the time comes we will definitely answer you please keep it coming we will definitely answer you thank you and until we meet again remain blessed